Hey everyone, it's from Anime Jackson, and today in this video, I'm talking about whether or not Stein Skate deserves all the praise that it gets. Now, Stein Skate has a very gripping story, it's a very strong story, but at the same time, if you don't watch it with your full attention on it, it will make no sense to you. Especially at the start, it's very hard to follow at the start, and at the end at times it can be hard to follow as well. So if you actually don't put your full attention onto it, then it's going to make no sense to you. Like, I described the story for Star and Skate, like, how much effort it is to watch it. Not that it's an effort, but how much energy, like, how much concentration you need to be able to understand the story of don't be drunk. If you are drunk, you're not going to understand it. Don't even drink anything. If you drink alcohol, you're not going to understand what happens. You need all the brain cells that you have at the moment to understand Steins Gate. That is how much of an in-depth story it has. Now, the art style for Steins Gate is rather nice. I find it somewhat unique, actually. I, I don't know, it's just got something about it that you just see it and you go, oh yeah, that, that's there's Steins Gate. It's, it's nothing other than Steins Gate. Steins Gate also, with uniqueness to Steins Gate, has some of the most unique characters I think I have seen in any anime. So in anime in general, Stein Skate is very unique with its characters, and that there is an awesome thing to have. But at the same time, and I am sorry, it is just starting to rain here, so if you can hear it, I apologise. But because of how unique the characters are, it can be hard to relate to them. And one more thing that I really like about Stein Skate is that it's based in Akihabara. I reckon that's really cool. It's based in the anime hub of the world. Okay, you can go to Japan itself as the anime hub of the world, but Akihabara is the anime hub for the world. Like, you go to Tokyo, you go to Akihabara if you are a fan of the anime. Well, that's just how I see it. Anyway, I do personally see why some people won't like Steins Gate. I do. But because this is a video where I said my opinion, I love Steins Gate. I do. And with that, I reckon it's worth all the praise that it gets. I really do. I don't think that it's a show that's overhyped. I reckon that it would be really hard to overhype Steins Gate because it is such a very in-depth story and hard to explain. Yeah, I don't reckon it's overhyped and I reckon that it deserves all the praise that it gets. It's a phenomenal series. Anyway, let me know in the comment section below whether or not you reckon that Steins Gate deserves all the praise that it gets or if it doesn't deserve all the praise that it gets. State your opinion. I'm interested to hear what you guys say. But yeah, thank you for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, give it a like or comment that you did down in the comment section below while you answer that question I asked. If you want to see more content by me, but check out my channel, you might find another video or two that you like look of. Or consider subscribing to me, be a great help to me, and you get to stay up to date when I've more videos. Again, thank you all for watching, and I hope to see you all next time in the next video. See ya.